Hey Tristan, can I borrow your phone, bro? Nice pass. Bro, you need to get a new phone, it's 2017. Oh, Lorenzo, there you are. Come over here. Where? Help me with this, in the corner. Whoa! Voila! Bro, look at this. Welcome to 2017! What's up, dude? This is your boy David here, and today we will be, or, or I will be, going to review the Samsung Galaxy Note 3. So, mine the uh, case, this is my brother, so eh, it's a bit kind of childish, but I can't force him to, to move that anyway. So, the Note 3, we will be going to review this, and its specs, capabilities, and the personal review and if if we would recommend it or I would so first first of all let's see the specs of the Galaxy Note 3 so it says here that the Galaxy Note 3 has a 5.7 inches which has a 1080p display very good its camera on the rear is 13 megapixels which can record 4k 30 fps videos which is awesome i my first 4k record was when we were back in japan and next its ram is 3 gigabytes that has a snapdragon 800 also nice but Kinda uh, updated. Its battery is 3200 mAh, which is awesome, it's still above 3000 and still better when it comes to the iPhone. The iPhone. The iPhone. The iPhone battery. Yes. So it says here that when it was released, the Note 3. When it was September of 2013, and its display has Super AMOLED, and the resolution again 1080p, which has a 386 pixel per inch density, multi touch, yes, Konin Gorilla Glass 3, and its base operating system is. Android 4, 4, 4 <laughs> sorry guys, 4.3 Jelly Bean, upgradable to KitKat and Lollipop. Its CPU, here is the nice one, is a quad core that runs on a 2.3 GHz, rate 400, 9, and 9005 and 9002. I don't know what that is, so you, can, you guys can explain it to me. Its GPU is a Dreno 330, which is updated like heck. It's been four years, so I don't judge because it's this phone is was released in 2013. So the Note 7, oh not that the Note 6 is nice. Note 7 is old, so yeah, not by that guys. Again, the camera of the rear is 13 megapixels. With LED flash, 2.2 f aperture, 31 millimeters of the focus. Nice. I, I didn't want to check the quality yet, but I know because I use this phone quite a lot as well. So the video can again record up to 4K 30 FPS, 1080p 60 FPS, and more lower resolutions than that. The secondary camera is can record up to 1080p 30 fps but the bad thing here is it's just 2 megapixels so f the aperture is f 2.4 and that's about it on the specs the next one what 
did we experience with the Galaxy Note 3, the past series? First, we just we inherited this from our father, so it's nice because we had uh, we have uh, we got a new phone at least. It's very nice. Can do a lot of things, even though even though it was already updated when we got it. But still a quad core, still has three gigabytes of RAM, still has a three times twelve milliamps per battery. Joking, okay, not anything. Okay, so again, mind the hair, mind mind my voice and. But why John is it here because he's playing downstairs with our neighbor by playing 2K17 and Star Wars Battlefront which I want to play but I need to do this so power guys power so would I recommend the Samsung Galaxy Note 3 in 2017 maybe if you, if you will if you are going to be inheriting the phone yes if, you, if you're going to buy the phone no I would recommend the Note 6 or Note 5 Note, Note 7 I won't because it, it explodes so guys that's all for today for the review of the Galaxy Note 3 again this is Rebel Tech and see you in the next one peace out